I think he's going to be going hard until that final whistle blows. And after a very lopsided first half, we'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. Westbrook and Harden, the dynamite pair. They're the backcourt. Kevin Love out there with Thompson. And it's Tucker in at the small forward position. They're the group for Mike D'Antoni starting the second half. Nice shot by James. You know, a six foot eight with the ball skills that James has, he handles it like a guard. He can get wherever he wants to off the dribble. Westbrook kicks it to Tucker. That three off the mark. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one, Greg. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. The Los Angeles, they have made 10 of their 14 tries at the free throw line in the game. Shooting two. Free throw good from Caldwell Pope. And Caldwell Pope drops them both. Rockets trail by 20. On the wing, Harden. He's guarded by Caldwell Pope. And Davis sends it back. <laughs> that free throw good from Thompson. Thompson nails both. And here is LeBron. Second half rolling along now. About a minute play here. Does not go down. That miss makes him 7 for 12 in the game. Westbrook drives in and finished off by Westbrook. And you know Westbrook has an outstanding vertical. Once he gets to the launching pad, rim, beware. Outside Rose, back to James. And Thompson sends it back. And here comes Harden, leading the fast break. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Harden's got his second basket of the night. I really appreciate how Harden handles contact. Staying in control of his body and tremendous balance. Caldwell Pope trying to break free. LeBron, no luck. And they're one of four here to start the second half. Outside Westbrook passes it to Harden. Let's it go from deep. The offensive rebound. Tries yet again. Shot is good in the Los Angeles leads. Cut down now to just 12 points with the basket from Thompson. Really strong rebounding on the interior. And he gets the easy putback. Now here's LeBron. He's got 14. This one for three. Another miss by Kane. And the stroke definitely lacking confidence this quarter. Nothing on target. Caldwell Pope against Harden. Pass to Tucker. Wallace with it. Shot clock at five. Houston needs to get a shot. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. And on the screen now is the 2K leaderboard with the rundown of this postseason's assist leader. LeBron James second. Fourth, Derrick Rose. I think these two guys are having a little personal competition here in the playoffs to see who will finish with the most assists. And it's Kuzma with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. They led the game at one point by 20. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. 
Boy, picture-perfect teamwork that time, guys. One guy sacrificing for the other. That's how you succeed in this league. by 15. Outside Westbrook. Slammed home and he draws the foul. James for another point at the free throw line. That one on Rose. That should give him a nice little jolt. Uh, yeah, it has to. They need a jolt GM. And you know, that's exactly what happens when you don't settle. That's the result. Tremendous effort and a big time finish there. Los Angeles leading by 12. LeBron outside. And he gets the bucket. James has got four points in the quarter. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. And it's been a well-rounded performance. I mean, strong rebounding has certainly been, at, been at, the, at the center of it, but it's been good on a number of levels. Timeout called the Rockets. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. And, you know, I think he's going to tell them simply, we have to show more fight on the interior. That's the top priority right now. Houston against Richie. Bosch is checked in. Alex Caruso, who's checked in for Los Angeles. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. Westbrook up top. He's got 24. And James picks up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. And the Lakers making a change here. Holmes checked in. Outside Westbrook. Outside Bosch. Five on the clock. Over Davis. The Rockets with another miss. Fantastic positioning there to contest that one. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, he challenged the shot, and you can see the effects on the release of that shot. I mean, it turned a simple jumper into a tough one. Now, here is Davis. 28 points for him. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. So here is Houston. Rockets trail by 16. Now Westbrook. Here's the floater. He lays it in. Westbrook's got seven points for the quarter. Boy, he's doing everything he can at this point. The rest of his teammates need to step up and give him some help. Holmes with it. Here's Caruso. Shot clock at six. Pass to Caldwell Pope. That shot, no good. Good D by Harden. Houston's gone 0-2 from deep to start things here in the second half. Now, here's Westbrook. 26 points for him. Bobbed up there for Thompson. It's stolen by Davis. Here's Caruso. He's covered by Westbrook. Caruso looking for an opening. Shoots over Tucker. They grab their own miss. Kuzma. No good with the layup. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. They get it back. Thompson, and the rejection by Holmes. 
Here's Caruso. It's rebounded by Houston. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. And you know what, guys? That will pump him up because he takes a ton of pride in what he does on defense. Now, here's Kuzma following the miss by Russell Westbrook. And it's good for two. And the Lakers lead by 16. How about that wonderful floater he has? Showing off an exquisite touch. And so Westbrook will bring it up for Houston. Fires for three. Best it is good. The assist from Box. Westbrook's got 29. I'll tell you what, guys. There's not much more he can do. I mean, he's been on fire. Yet they still trail in this game. Los Angeles calls timeout. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. Houston with a big group substitution here. Johnson, he's checked in for Tristan Thompson. Daniel House comes in for P.J. Tucker. Austin Rivers, he's checked in for James Harden. And Shabazz Napier subbed in for Russell Westbrook. And then for Los Angeles, Marvin Bagley's checked in for Davis. Lights out comes in for Contavious Caldwell Pope. Rajon Rondo subbed in for Alex Caruso. Here's Napier after Rajon Rondo's bucket. Johnson outside. There's the three. Rebounded by Holmes. Holmes got four rebounds in this game. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. Yeah, you look across the board, it's actually sizing up, shaping up to be a great game. I mean, strong performances throughout, and they've really been strong on the glass. Rivers can't get it to go. Lakers leading by 17. Here's Bagley, and he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now, Greg. They've allowed from point-blank range. Can't happen. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for Los Angeles. Their defense has been outstanding, closing out on shots and blocking a few as well. They haven't wasted time getting the ball up the court tonight either, and it's resulted in a lot of fast break points. And if they continue, Kevin, their outstanding free throw shooting, that'll help them seal the deal. Yeah, they've not missed a single foul shot this half. That's taking care of business, fellas. Now, here's Miles. Brings it from nine feet away. Miles has got five now. Love the tenacity from Miles. Just simply skying up and finishing strong inside. Here's Rondo. The shot, no good. Excellent D there by Johnson. Miles against Kuzma. Johnson outside. Kicks it to Napier. Over Rondo. And it's Napier missing. Los Angeles leading by 18. Outside for Rondo. The pass to Kuzma. And stolen by Napier. Here's Rivers. The Lakers with the rebound. Bagley's got four rebounds in this game. Outside Rondo. And he banks in the layup. Rondo's got four points this quarter. Rondo just being creative there on that drive, finding different ways to burn the D whenever he penetrates. Now here's Rivers. The train. Kuzma pulls it in. It's just been a brutal outing for him. He still hasn't managed to make a shot, and the team is struggling because of it. Count that one. McGee has got his second basket of the game. Hey, there's a reason why he shoots such a high percentage, guys. I mean, he picks smart shots, high-quality shots, and close shots that he takes. Now, here's Napier. He's got five. Trains the three-pointer. He's got eight. Yeah, not a perfectly set screen there, but got him just enough room to get that shot off. Rondo dishes to Bagley. Back to Rondo.
Pass to Begley. We've got 155 left in the third. The shot's good from Kuzma. Well, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. They keep getting it in the paint and continue to score consistently. Here's Napier. The shot, no good. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively. Here's lights out. He's guarded by Ridley. The rebound by Johnson. And it's just one of those days, guys. He has just struggled to shoot the basketball. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. It's on Rajon Rondo. And the line from your rights, CJ Miles. Taking two shots. And the first one drops. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Yeah, you know what? And I think they've just got to keep on keeping on. Keep drawing contact, attacking, getting to the line. That will certainly give them a chance to get back into the game. And the Rockets making a change here. Love's checked in. And then for Los Angeles, LeBron comes in for Kyle Kuzma. And it's Rose in for Rajon Rondo. Lakers leading by 19. Pass to LeBron. Rebound, Love. Love's got his eighth rebound here tonight. And here's Napier. Five points in the game. Love outside. Good, and it's Napier with the assist that time. Napier's got four assists now tonight. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Well, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Now, here's Bagley. He's got 11. James finds Rose, and he's good on the three ball. Rose has got himself going there, his first points of the game on the deep ball. Rockets trail by 19. Napier passes to Rivers. Tried to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Putting up a goose egg bagel this period. At this point, you have to run the offense through somebody else. I mean, that's your only choice. Now Napier. To the wing on the left. McGee with the block. With one on the clock. He doesn't hit that one. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit will make it tough to come back. Los Angeles on top, up 19. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get started for the fourth quarter. Here now a chance to show you our assist of the game, and it's presented as always by State Farm. It's just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball, and how about the perfect delivery? And they'd love to see every possession in this way. True team basketball. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. And Zonapier will bring it up for Houston. 19-point game. And on the court for the Lakers to start the fourth. Derrick Rose is out there with lights out. And there's JaVale McGee. Then it's Bagley. And it's James in at the three spot. Pass to Bagley. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. and they're shooting poorly just 35% so far. Miles with it. Now the pass to Love. Shoots over McGee and Kevin Love. The bucket with the assist from Miles. 
Nine points for Kevin Love. Boy, Love is really good at getting inside the paint. Establishing position has an excellent feel for how to score around the basket. Good D by Love. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. Passes to LeBron. Looking to get it going. Back to Rose. Takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. And the Lakers lead by 15. For Houston, they've gotten all three of their shots to drop here in the fourth quarter. They came out of the break on a roll. Love outside. Good, and it's Napier with the assist that time. 14 points for Love. Well, it sure is a lot of fun watching Love bury these outside shots. I mean, when he's hitting from deep, it opens up things for everybody. Now, here's Bagley. Here's lights out to Bagley. Fires from deep. Rockets with the rebound. Miles has got more rebounds now tonight. Pass to Love for three. No good on the shot. So the Lakers will take it the other way. 22 is their biggest lead. Here's James, and there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul, shot misses. He'll be shooting two. And Houston gets called for the foul. That one is off. And you know, when you played over a decade and a half in the league, it's expected that you're going to slow down. But LeBron still going strong. Looking at who's out there now for the Rockets. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Daniel House. P.J. Tucker comes in for C.J. Miles. James Harden, he's checked in for Austin Rivers. And Russell Westbrook subbed in for Napier. He hits the second from the line. Yeah, and good job bringing that free throw percentage up here in the second half. Doing a great job at the line. Pass to Tucker. Lots of room. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. Squaring up with confidence, Tucker just continues to make a variety of plays for this team. It's Davis on the wing. Back to Rose. Doesn't go that time. Good D by Love. Here's Houston now. They're on an 11-3 run right now. Westbrook against Rose. Right side, Westbrook, and he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That one on Davis. First one falls for <laughs> And Russell Westbrook drops a bolt. The Lakers with the ball. They have a nine-point lead. Rose passes to James. A three. Rockets with the rebound. Wow, what a rough second half of him shooting the basketball. Maybe you adopt a, a pass-first mentality at this point. Here's Tucker. Thompson dishes to Tucker. To the paint, and another shot. And Westbrook gets it to go on the assist by Love. And that's now 33 points for Russell Westbrook. Lakers lead by seven. Rose looking around over Westbrook. 
And again, the Lakers, no good. You know, even though they're on top in this one, you'd like him to be better out there because he's capable of being better. It sure would make things a lot easier, too. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain momentum. Well, it starts with defense. They got some stops, scored some buckets after that, and now we've got ourselves a ball game. Los Angeles calls timeout. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Frank Vogel talk to his team during the break. He said, guys, we don't want to play hero ball. We don't want to take threes that aren't there. There are better options when you run the offense all the way through. Never will see if they can make that adjustment. Thank you, David. And Love has it in the corner. From outside, off the mark. And so it's Rose bringing it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Here's Caldwell Pope. Back to Rose. Westbrook with the block. Harden against Davis. Harden, no good. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. And you know, guys, I love his fight and grit on the interior. I mean, he never lets a shot go uncontested. LeBron with Westbrook picks him up. Leads back. The rebound by Harden. You know what? Just a little fancy on that possession there. Just go up. Oh, oh, oh. Well, they left it until the fourth quarter, but finally the run they needed to get back into this. I didn't think it was going to happen for them, quite honestly, but they finally turned it on, turned it up a little bit. Now they've got to come up with some stops. James. Dives for it, and out of bounds as the Rockets gain possession. Kyle Kuzma's checked in for the late. Rockets on offense. They're on a 19 to 5 run here. Caldwell Pope against Harden. Launches it. And Davis pulls it down. Davis has got rebound number 19 now. Incredible board work. It's trailed by five. Harden outside. It's stolen by Davis. And pushing it up. Here's Los Angeles. Rose has got the ball. And Davis puts it in. Davis has got 30. He's certainly been their go-to guy when it matters most. He's trying to close this one out. No one near Westbrook as he lets it go. And the three ball is good. You really got to tip your cap to him in terms of how he's played today, even if they end up losing this game. Here's LeBron. Battles through traffic and lays it in. LeBron's got 21 in the game. That's as good as you can defend LeBron inside, and it's still not good enough. Harden outside. But they get it back. Thompson finds Tucker, and the layup's good off the glass. And you don't want to allow too many of those short ones with the game right now in the battle. Rose against Westbrook. Here's Davis, and finished off by Davis. Rose, a very solid floor general. I think that's an underrated part of his game. He's excellent at finding his teammates. Harden against Caldwell Pope. Steps back and fires. That one's in there. The Lakers lead is cut down to just four points in the bucket from Harden. And that's right in his wheelhouse. Looking to make an impact when he counts. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. Caldwell Pope outside. No good on the three. Houston's got a disappointing two or six on three-point attempts here in the fourth. Now, here's Westbrook. And James picks up the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game.
outside Westbrook. Over Rose. That one's in there. The Lakers lead is cut down now to just two on the basket from Russell Westbrook. And Westbrook is a terror from the mid-range. Terrific at sticking it to the defense from that spot on the floor. And that one's good. James. LeBron's got 23 points. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. And here's Harden. With a floater, and Davis sends it back. He's been ice cold tonight. And, you know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. And the fadeaway was the only option he had on that one. Defender there all over. And Tucker kicks to Harden. The pass to Lark. Six to shoot. And it's good. And it's a six make against the weather attempts. And really, the scoring this quarter has been just off the charts, doing all he can to bring them back. LeBron has doubled. And Kuzma has it in the corner. Count that one. And the Lakers lead by four. He's such a clutch shooter, Kevin. He just lives for the big shot. Side Westbrook. Out to the wing. From the arc. Tucker can't get it to go. Los Angeles has gone ice cold from three-point land. 0-4 since the start of the final quarter. That's serving it up on the platter there. What a nice pass. A high percentage look was the result. Here's Thompson. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the content. Free throw, no good. possession here. Caldwell Pope against Harden. 156 left to play here in the fourth. Thompson misses. Yeah, and that was lining up to be a huge alley oop but they just couldn't quite connect. And you know guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. Just creating havoc for the opponents the last few games. Well, he's done it again right there on the offensive glass. I mean, it's a great stretch that he's having here. Boy, I really admire his energy. And you know what? If you're the defense, you got him right where you want to. Let him keep shooting those threes because he's been brutal in this half. Now, here's James. And they double up Davis. Mm -hmm. Just add that one to the highlight reel. James is truly one of the greatest slam dunkers of all time. Harden against Caldwell Pope. That one's in there. The Lakers really step down to seven in the bucket from Harden. And that's what he does. I mean, he is a bucket getter. One ten left in the fourth. Rose passes to James. He gets that one. And the Lakers lead by nine. Saw the opportunity to put this away and did not turn it down. And, you know, this run shows what kind of attitude this team has. I mean, the win is there. Go get it. Thompson with the bucket. You've got to be aware of him at all times. He's a bully on the backboard. LeBron outside. Let's it go with the three. Drills it from outside. LeBron's got 30. 
and they came in determined to take this one. It's going to be a happy flight home. Yep, to have a stress-free win on the road, very satisfying. The fans are already headed for the exit. Here's Thompson, and Thompson throws it down. And when he's on the floor, offensive rebounding is always going to be a strength for him. Greg, he keeps so many possessions alive, doesn't he? And you know, those second chance opportunities can be game changing. He represents so much value to this team because of what he does. Tucker can't get it to go. And that was a little bit of a range check for him. You know, guys, I think he's got confidence to shoot it from anywhere, but he could have gotten a better one than that. And so the Lakers take the win. And now they're sitting on a commanding three games to one lead. They grab this series by the throat, Greg. And, and, and Kevin, I don't think they're going to let it go. You could see the determination they had tonight. They don't want to drag this series out. They want to get this thing over with. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks, Kevin. Anthony, tell us the focus for the team coming into the game tonight. Well, you know, before we started the game, the you know, coach came in and told us that we knew what we had to do. You know, we were trying to stop a lot of the action. And, you know, our biggest focus for the game was guarding the ball. Um, That's what we did, come out of that timeout and never look back. And it led to a win. Thank you for your time, Anthony. Back to you, Kevin. David, thank you as always. Well, that'll do it, folks. Glad you could join us for the Western Conference semifinals. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. We'll see you later.